What we saying everyone, it's your boy Jordan, aka Jaws Reacts, and welcome back to this reaction channel on YouTube where I'm in the rhythm, the vibes, and the positive energy every day with no fail. And I hope you enjoyed the first two reactions so far today. The first reaction was to Sam Tompkins, someone else, which is a beautiful tune with him coming through some beautiful vocals, with him talking about finding, falling in love with someone who's also in love with someone else, you know what I'm saying? So it's a big tune, and I really suggest you check that reaction out. And the second tune was an even bigger tune, there's John Cook standing next to you, which is a beautiful tune with him coming through with like a funk disco kind of beat, like the A is kind of feel whilst at the same time coming through with the heavy vocals that he comes with with some beautiful choreography that give you some heavy Michael Jackson vibes you know what I'm saying and this third reaction is going to be a very interesting reaction because this is going to be the Beatles in Now and Then which I can see right here there's also a short film that goes along with this tune which says this was the last song that was ever created by the Beatles so this is going to be a big tune for me to react to because I really do want to coach myself up on the Beatles because they are a group that I've really been wanting to listen to for a very long time and I have grown up kind of listening to them but like on and off you know what I'm saying so I don't know many of the tunes I only know like a couple of them. So my most favourite tune that I do know of the Beatles is Yellow Submarine. And that's like the main one that I do know. So if you do want to see me react to any more Beatles tunes, please let me know in the comments of any of the most popular tunes or any of your favourite tunes that you want to see me react to. You know what I'm saying? But this tune right here, I'm also really excited to react to. Because it's interesting to see what tune they ended it on and how they really sounded by the end of their career. Because I feel like the tunes that I have listened to of them before was them in their prime. You know what I'm saying? So I'm really interested to see how they sounded by the end of their career and the tunes that they were really going for when they were finishing off. You know what I'm saying? And I do recall that one of their members died so I feel like there might be only four of them if there were five of them in the group so if you can let me know a little bit of context behind this tune and if you do want to react to the short film I will be reacting to it on stream when I do stream next you know what I'm saying so to catch you when I'm next live on stream we will be reacting to this short film if you do want to react to it you know what I'm saying so let's get to this reaction of the Beatles now and then this is going to be a beautiful tune to end off the day and I hope you'll enjoy it let's get into it and let's go Bosh. Right, this is the Beatles, now and then. I'm really excited to react to this because I'm really excited to see how they sounded at the end of their career compared to how I remember them sounding when I listened to the Yellow Submarine, you know what I'm saying? So, this is going to be a beautiful tune and a beautiful tune to end off the day. And it's going to be level three to the levels that we have been going through with it today's reaction, you know what I'm saying? We ended it off with the Goats, the Beatles. Let's go. One, two, three. Ooh, two, three, two, three. in the way this tune starts it off right now really subtly but it's also kind of haunting in a way you know what i'm saying because one of their members did pass away they could be talking about him because of you we can't really continue anymore you know what i'm saying like it really gets you thinking about what you're talking about with these lyrics right now especially how they're starting it off so soft and so mysterious in a way it's like leading you to think who they're talking about you know what i'm saying but this is beautiful so far let me go back to this and let's go This is a heavy tune. Oi! Wow! I do kind of feel like they might be talking about their member that did pass away because they're saying now and then we have to start again but I will always love you, you know what I'm saying? Like I feel like they could be talking about the person that did pass away. I do apologise that I don't know his name. I should have really done some research before this video, you know what I'm saying? But I really appreciate all the context that's in the comments. I really appreciate all the people that do show the context when it's needed, you know what I'm saying? But wow, this tune's really getting you thinking. And because it is the last tune that they ever made, it's kind of emotional, you know what I'm saying? Because you kind of know that they're going to have to restart and I'm like, I'm really going through the wrong laughs individually, you know what I'm saying? Sheesh, this is crazy, let's go. <laughs> Oh, now and then. Oh, now and then. Oh, I want you to be 
Back at hell, they're all singing collectively as well, whilst at the same time they're all on their own little instruments. And then that one artist, I don't know his name, but I appreciate the context, who's just coming through and singing on his own. Because of you, you know what I'm saying, with that raspy voice, it really like moves the tone from when they're singing collectively to him on his own. The tone just switches, you know what I'm saying? You really can feel the atmosphere when he's singing alone compared to when he's singing together. And that's what makes this tune really special in my opinion, because of this, because the contrast of him singing alone compared to when the chorus is hitting, it just hits so different, you know what I'm saying? And this is a massive tune right now. Wow. This is a massive tune right now, and I'm really liking this tune. I'm probably going to be saving it, because, wow, it's catchy. You can kind of relate to it in a way, and the way that they're singing, it just feels so soulful and at home, you know what I'm saying? Especially when I'm from the UK, I can kind of relate to it when they're singing it in the UK accent, you know what I'm saying? So, let's get to it, and let's go. And I should have loads of people behind me just applauding with me, you know what I'm saying? Wow, that was a heavy tune right there, wow. Wow, that was a serious tune right there, and especially for their last ever tune, that was so crazy, because you can kind of think about who they're talking about when they're singing like, now and then, I really miss you, and because of you, we have to restart and stuff like that. Like, it's so beautiful, the things they were talking about in this tune, because this was their last tune, how they're gonna have to go and find themselves in new paths, individually, whilst at the same time, remembering what they did in the past, whilst also remembering and missing what they did, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can really tell in this tune that they are really sad to find a new path in life, but at the same time, they are kind of happy that they are leaving that, oh, and they are kind of leaving it behind and leaving it with a good memory, you know what I'm saying? But that good memory is always going to be missed and you always want to go back to it to kind of find comfort, you know what I'm saying? And that's what this tune was all about, was finding comfort in the old memories that you have to walk away from to really start a new memory, to really start a new life, you know what I'm saying? This is a beautiful tune and a beautiful soul and a beautiful vibe and a beautiful atmosphere from the way that the contrast were between them not singing as a group and, and then that person singing individually was so insane and it really set the tone for that tune, especially with it being their last tune, you know what I'm saying? So if you do want to react to the short film, please let me know in the comments and I will be reacting to it live on stream, you know what I'm saying? But if you haven't enjoyed this reaction and you want to show some support, hit that like button. If you want to show some more support and see some more videos, hit that subscribe button. And put it down in the comments what tunes you want to react to next. Hope you stay blessed, stay positive, stay motivated, keep striving to the best version of yourself. I'll see you all in the next reaction. Take care and peace. Bosh.